What's up? We are here. We are here. We got a candlelight dinner. And hopefully we can get a get a interview with Johannes. This is a video, but are you excited? La 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 la. I'm dreaming. La 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 la. When times are rough, you just gotta stay up and just be driven. Take life one step at a time and just know what's all with living. Giddy up, let's go, be motivated and stay driven. You got one chance at life, don't tell me it's not worth living. Breathe in, breathe out, come on now, just let it out. Be focused on the path you chose now, they're forgiven. Just do your best, forget the rest, and make it happen. The time will come when they look up to you and say you're driven. I know I've not done something like this in a while. It was mostly vlogs of me going to different places. But today, I'm actually going to be seeing a new good friend uh, who is an amazing, talented guitarist. His name is Johannes Lindstedt. You got to check this guy out. He's amazing. So we're actually going to see him perform live today. But um, just a little info of what's happening behind me. I'm not going to give away too much, but something big is happening. And um, I just, I'm just gonna show you the back setup. That's it, that's it. That's all I'm gonna show you. Uh, but it's gonna be something great, so stay tuned. If you haven't seen me posting so much stuff, or uh, too many content, it's because I'm working, all right? Remember, I am working, working. Uh, on something big. And I don't know when it's gonna get released, but I am working, working on it and it's gonna be released soon. So anyways, I'm gonna get ready and we are gonna head out to the venue. All right, to see Johannes Lindstedt play. Yeah, play. He's an amazing guitarist. Did I say that already? You're gonna check him out. All right. We are off to see Johannes Lindstedt. Beautiful, significant other. Anyways, we're gonna go for some dinner and see what the show is all about. All right, time lapse from here to the show. All right, here we go. So what can play out is the model to be living. Well, that was a mission to get here, but we got here, right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> all right, here we go. We are walking over to the venue. And it's pretty cold. <laughs> yes. <laughs> What's up? We are here. We are here. We got a candlelight dinner. And hopefully we can get a get a interview with Johannes. This is a video, but. Are you excited? Uh, yes. Oh, here's some water. All right, hang on. Line of 3030 Dumbass West. Uh, welcome to everyone on streaming. I saw a great influx of uh, people streaming the show this evening as well, so we can't forget about you. Well, welcome. Thank you. My name is Michael Booth. I'm the executive director of Use Room Live, and it's such a pleasure to have you all here tonight and to have this wonderful artist, Johannes Lindstedt, with us here tonight. Yes. Save that applause up because there'll be plenty of reasons for it soon enough. Before we get started, I first want to do a big thank you to the good people at Wave FM who sponsored and promoted this show and our partners in presenting this evening. We're very grateful to them. Yes, we indeed over there, you, you Wave FM people, you. Thank you very much for your support of live music and of Hughes Room Live. So, also before we start with a bit of business, I do want to mention that Toronto is located on the traditional territory of several nations including the Mississaugas of the Credit, the Anishabeg, the Chippewa, the Haudenosaunee, the Wendat peoples, is covered by Treaty 13. The Mississaugas of the New Credit is now home to members of many nations. And as uh, Bruce Coburn, 
for who we're doing a tribute on March 9th. I'll we'll slip that in there as well. Down at uh, Revival next Thursday night. Uh, said in 1987, it's a stolen land and there's no going back. So we gather here in peace tonight to, change, to exchange stories, to share our love of music and live performance. And we're pleased to welcome you to do that here and, uh, and what a, a bit of live music we're going to experience. If uh, you have not seen uh, Johannes Lindstedt and his group, you are certainly in for a treat. From having over 350 million streams on Pandora Radio, to being named Canada's Guitarist of the Year, to winning eight Best Album Awards, seven Top Ten U.S. Billboard charting albums, and the People's Choice Award in the U.K., He's become recognized internationally as one of the best-selling guitarists in the inter instrumental new age jazz and global music genres. He's an endorsed influential uh, artist with Yamaha guitars. Yamaha right there. They're also actually very supportive of Hughes Room Live and we're grateful to Yamaha. Uh, he is, uh, he is uh, his 11th album, Bohemian Strings, is available in the lobby as you leave the theater or at the intermission. At the merch table at the back, I'm sure he'll be very happy to sign and, and sell you a few copies. That's really, he's an incredible musician. I've had the pleasure uh, in a previous life at Jazz Event 91 to welcome him into our studio in the COVID days for a jaw-dropping performance with just two musicians. And tonight there's five, so please give a big hand to Johannes Lindstedt and welcome him to the stage here at Newsroom Live at 30 first show in many, many months. We also have a new drummer, so give him a round of applause. His name is Junior Santos, so we're going to the Republic. And this is his first show with us, so we hope you guys are going to be really patient with us. We're going to do the best we can. I'm just kidding. We're going to rock. And we're going to start with a song called Santa Maria.
for some audience participation. This next song is called, who's seen this before, first of all? A few people? Okay, so you probably know all my jokes then. Oh. Okay, this next one is called Swing Palms, and since we don't have any palm trees here, we do have these palms, so we can sway them. You get it? Swing palms? You guys get it? Yeah, okay. So just sort of follow me, and I'm gonna get Jeff to kick in. So it goes a little bit like this. That's it. Jeff, is that right? Come on, I see a few of you not doing it. Don't make me look bad. Well, that's better. Yeah, okay.
Okay, we're gonna do one that's gonna make you guys sweat. This is a little cha 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 called Mevoy Manana. And you feel if you feel like dancing, come on up, don't be shy. We'd love to see you dance.
Thank you very much. I feature Jeff Lipka on guitar. Olivia Brown on bass. Jordan Abraham on piano. And Junior Santos on drums. We've got one more song to do for this set. This, is, this one's gonna make you. That was a freaking amazing show. Uh, well, obviously there's more to it. I don't know if you guys can hear me. My face is really close to my, the phone. Get some ambient light here. Ah, oh, there we go. So, um, yeah, it's pretty cool. His guitar skills and the rest of the band are amazing. I'm gonna try to get an interview with him. I did mention, I did talk to him earlier. So we get a nice interview with him and uh, see what he has to say. Other than that, make sure you check out. He's got some more short dates coming up. Check it out. And uh, make sure you follow his uh, Spotify link and check it out. Check him out there, all right? We are with Johannes Lindstedt. Amazing show. Johannes, man. Thank you. Thank you so much. You are a talented, talented person. Appreciate Seriously, that. the guitar playing. I saw your fingers just going all crazy. Yeah. How long have you been playing, playing the guitar for? Oh, man. I started when I was about eight years old, so a long time. Eight years old, yeah, right? Yeah. yeah, we can see the talent here. But uh, it wasn't until I was about maybe 12 years old I really became obsessed. Oh, I see. And then from then on, I have not put it down. I mean, especially in high school, when I was supposed to be doing homework and things like that, I was practicing eight hours a day, even right. with school. Oh, I see. So oh, wow. lots of practicing. So who's the inspiration? Inspiration for my music, um, I would say mostly is classical music like Mozart, Mozart okay. but also um, music from the Caribbean like salsa, right. merengue, the Latin rhythms, I love that a lot. Yeah. And even music from India I, I really, really love. So musically I, I draw from many different cultures, uh, but as far as guitar playing goes, lots of different guitar players, rock guitar players. Uh, when I was in my teens I discovered Randy Rhodes who passed away sadly uh, a long time ago. Um, guitar players like Aldi Miola, he's a fusion guitar player. Flamenco guitar players like Paco de Lucia, um, Strunson Farah, lots of different guitar players. And even to this day, there's still guitar players that I discover and think, wow, you can learn something from everybody. Yeah, that's true. Man, you know what? You're very talented. I'm glad I came to the show and Thank you. to actually see someone like in real time doing and playing all the songs. You guys, you gotta listen to him. I'm gonna put his link down there. Follow him on Spotify. Check him out. And what's your advice to artists like me uh, who are trying to make it, man? What, what's what's some advice you can give anybody who's pursuing their dreams? I would say just keep being creative. Keep creating new music. Um, you know, try different things. Find your niche. I think when you find your niche, something that really stimulates your soul. I can't say success is guaranteed, but even if you're not famous, doing something that you love is a success in its own way. So that's, it, man. that's, that's what it. I would recommend. All right, guys, that's it. Hope you enjoyed that. Make sure you follow him and check him out, all right?